I say, while they sent him some trolls and uh, since Swagger Knight brought it up, don't forget you can subscribe to us here on twitch.tv slash games. You can also follow us on YouTube, uh, YouTube slash games and Twitter at typehousegames. Uh, we will be at Battle and Brew this Saturday and then Kapow on Sunday. Uh, I'm going to try and do a Friday night typo at uh, Typo HQ down Warner Robins. That'll be like a Smash Fest, uh, like, uh, what is it? Uh, and then bracket for bragging rights at the house. So if you guys would like to see that, be sure to tune in on Friday, assuming, you know, my computer doesn't blow up with these uploads. Uh, right now we have Lord Last versus Fax Machine. Fax Machine known for his Rory, uh, Lord Last. Uh, he's gone by many different names and he's played many different characters, but last I saw he was uh, playing uh, King K. Roll and uh, Inkling. Your mic's live, Ty. Yeah, this character, of course, like, as you'd expect, and again, Ooh. another just 
If he would have hit him off the left side to the right, that probably would have most likely been a kill. But yeah, this character's a real zoner with the grenades and everything. And the ink, I believe, uh, adds damage or this bigger knockback whenever Ooh. they're covered. And, and a nice kill right there. On reaction, too, on the approach. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Inkling, the experience I've played against him and with him, he just is a very zony character. And he could get really annoying real quick, especially with his grenades, too. And when Roy is covered in paint, is that just an aesthetic thing, or does that have an effect on no, his No, no, so it makes him, I believe it he has more knockback, is how it works in this Inkling's game. Inkling's attack will knock back more when the opponent's covered in the paint. Yes. Okay. And actually, fun fact, too, about Inkling, if you see that little line right by his little gauge, if his line, if his uh, amount of ink is under that line, he can't throw grenades, which grenades are his primarily, like, source of uh, oh. projectiles. All right, all right. Nice kill by Roy right there. Roy has a lot of killing potential in this game, too. So... Very close, actually. He could just clean this up. This game has a big comeback mechanic just of, like, damage being really insane with some characters. Just the short hops for the uh, nice nares right here. Nothing too much happening. Zoning with the nair in neutral. The can reminds me of Project M. Mm -hmm. yeah. And neither, neither player really wants to overcommit on an approach. They're both pretty safe, and so we've seen a lot of feeling each other out in the neutral game. Down throw up air, Roy's bread and butter. Yeah, both of the characters aren't in kill percent yet, I do not believe, unless something crazy happens. So we'll kind of see. Roy wow. might be now. Yeah. yeah. I, right now, I think he will be, especially since he's on the right side of the screen. Definitely tries to make it back to neutral, which is completely smart. I'll get rolled. J gets out as fast as possible. You do not want to get hit right there. That could have been easily game. He's at 128%. Uh, he could do something right here, but we're going to see. Does a laggy smash attack, but only gets punished with a back throw. Yeah. Gets him off stage, but he comes back on with the grab. He, needs, he, he needed that aerial. He needed that aerial to get a kill. He needs something right here. He needs just to keep him in the air. He needs to get a good like attack. Just go for a Hail Mary. There's not a lot he could do right here. Ooh, the dash forward into the stop All right. to space the air. Well, he went for everything right there, actually, but missed it. Inkling, I think, could kill off a grab right here. Maybe not. I don't know if Inkling's kill grabs are that crazy. And there is shield dropping in this game too. There is, right? there is. Now how does how does that work as opposed to melee? I actually do not know how. I was gonna try to learn it last night. But I don't either. I was playing on a on a friendly setup a minute ago trying to figure out how to shield drop and yeah. my shield drops in melee, if I do say so myself, are very consistent. Yeah. But I noticed rather quickly that the input mechanic for shield drop in this game is not at all the same. Yeah, I don't I don't think it's that like little tilt. And he might actually get the gimp right here. He goes for the down oh. smash. Oh and barely oh, no, gets back on hard. stage. I'm telling you, you could just get back on stage so easily with some of these characters, especially Inkling. Inkling goes so high up and he has no ink right there, tries to go through the roll. Like he's just kinda waiting. Ooh, all right, he's gonna air. get all his ink back recover? and that one. Yeah, he has all right, he gets jump. back. Honestly the worst part about that right there is just Inkling getting all that ink right back. So he oh. had him where he wanted him. Both had a very kill percentage. And, and it looks like that. Oh, oh, the Dragon Ball Z right there. Roy takes that back. Oh, that was kind of crazy. What a GameStop trade for Inkling. No. Wow. That was a Dragon Ball Z and a comeback all in one. Good stuff by the Roy player. Let's Both player Roy. characters played very well. I, I very much enjoyed that match. Super tight battle. Yeah. I feel like Inkling was Inkling was almost outplaying Roy more times in neutral. I feel like Inkling won more neutral exchanges, but Roy was able to capitalize on, I his, definitely think on that. his neutral wins more. Yeah. The, I think the you see Fax Machine shaking his head in between games. He he, he notices, too, he won more neutral exchanges. Oh, yeah. He should have had that. Game. And that you hate to see that. You hate to feel like you did more work, but you just don't get as much pay as the other person. You know what I'm saying? Absolutely. So. Oh, did I get the tags mixed up? Uh, Fax Machine's Roy. So is Lord. Yeah, Lord last. So they're going to go back to the same characters. We'll see. I feel like it was Final Destination, but we'll see. Definitely be a good stage for Roy, but Inkling as well. Since there's no platforms, you can just cover the whole stage of paint. So. Can, we, can we talk about how epic FD looks in this game? Oh, FD is beautiful. Every stage, honestly, is so beautiful in this game. Shoutouts to Sakurai for the sweet graphics. I'm going to be honest. This game is this pretty cool. Oh, it's, oh I thought right. that was going to spike. Yeah, I don't Hits know if that hit. spikes anymore. Maybe it does. Yeah, we had a recent patch to the game. Yeah. Spikes in this game are work very interesting, I noticed. Like, you can spike someone and it's like a meteor for in melee. There's not really too many so true spikes. every spike just about is a is meteor cancelable. Yeah. Ah, so, and especially with some of these characters, like Inkling, how he has such a high vertical recovery, a lot of, uh, really reminiscent of Game & Watch, actually. Yes. But, we'll see. The percent, uh, percent of the game is definitely in uh, favor of Roy right now. He's playing it really smart. He's got a good percent lead and he's got center stage. Uh, kind of gives him back center stage. The inkling is a half ink, but we'll see if he can just make anything off of this neutral stage. Roy seems a little eager to get this kill. I see him approaching a lot, which you generally don't want to do when you're in the lead. 
you get kind of greedy, you know. You, you feel like you have all the percent. All you need to do is just get one solid attack. But we'll see if that just makes him uh, a little too greedy. Especially when it's game two and you know you could get to 2-0. Mm -hmm. If he plays this right, he could just clean up this match right here and go on to winners. But here goes. Now the percents are starting to even up a bit. Yeah. Ooh. Gets a launcher. And boy. I'm telling you, man, that feels like shit killed, right? But no, nope. he doesn't have any ink, though. So as long as he doesn't let the inkling do that. And he can skill, actually. It's such a weird flight trajectory too. I don't know if trajectory is the right word. It's like the character flew all the way to the the last zone and then just like made it all the way back. Slowed too. down. Yeah. And didn't go past it. I don't know. My my theory so far is how there's that like slow motion effect is I feel like some attacks are triggered to the slow motion effect, so like there's very interesting properties oh, was when a, those sorry, don't that kill. Was a gutsy get up attack. That was very impressive. Short hop Nair. That grenade Did was that really still smart. Do damage? Uh, wasn't very sure. I wasn't really Power sure. Power shield did it bounced off, yeah. but it still exploded super close. It did keep him like busy for a second while we got back to ledge, which was really good. Gave him just enough time to get back to ledge safely. I'm loving the dash dance game by Roy. Yeah, the Roy. I think he just kind of got back into his fix. He's oh, and he gets the nice early kill on Inkling that's, off the right a, side. That's a three stock lead. I'm telling you that back air was kind of crazy. So he has the he has the two stock lead. He just honestly needs to just play with that to get as much percent as he can, and then just go from there. I which like it looks like he's doing it. Yeah, and I like what the inkling just did there a moment ago with the bomb, how it exploded, and he dashed forward while the bomb was exploding, forcing the Roy to shield so he could approach safely. I want to see him do that more because that setup looks really good. And there's not thing much he can do about it either. Oh yeah, and this Roy is uh, doing a lot of falling up airs too, which is uh, something that's really cool to watch. And I'm guessing it's a really good setup too. Shoutouts to Mangos Marth with the shout out. <laughs> <laughs> All right, get oh, that kill. Not quite. Yeah, he has such a good recovery, so he doesn't have to really worry. And it kind of angles too, as you just saw right there. Again, throws out the bomb to cover his recovery, and that not was yet. really close, but not yet. Roy has zero percent on his second stock, while Inkling does have a lot more percentage. So we're gonna see if he can just do something here, make a sick comeback. And it, yeah, it is. It is not over until the epic voice guy says game. <laughs> We're going to see. I know, you, of course, you're going to be scared right here. You're high percentage. You don't want to get hit. Just one good hit. But as long as that Roy is in the air looking at you, you're not going to get hit by much, honestly. That forward air can only do so much. The Roy's looking for a back air. He's looking for a forward smash. He's looking for a combo starter. Oh. And it looks like that was the back air that I, oh, yeah, that was the back air I was talking about.